Cold Children's Museum presents Home Zone, learning experiences you can do at home. Hi everyone, my name is Alex and today we are flying paper airplanes. So we are going to be investigating the strategies uh, for how to make the best paper airplane. Um, we're going to try with different types of paper and we're gonna see what fold is the best or how do we launch our paper airplane to make the furthest throw or how to make the most spirals in the air. So what you're gonna need is a, a couple pieces of paper, different types. You can get cardboard, you can get tissue paper, you can get regular paper, you can get old receipts. Um, it's all up to you and what you wanna try. Um, and if you want, you can take colored pencils and decorate your paper before you even start folding. Um, so I'm going to show you an easy way that uh, I learned how to fold a paper airplane. So you take your paper airplane or your piece of paper and you fold it hot dog style. So you fold it right in the middle to make it even. And then you're going to open it up and you're going to take the ears, this corner, and this corner, and you're gonna fold it to make a triangle to the line in the middle. See, so this is side one. You're gonna take the other corner and make another triangle. Great, so now your piece of paper should look like a house. And now you're gonna take this corner and fold it in. Fold it in to the middle to make another long triangle. So we have another triangle. And you do the same to the other side. Great. And now our piece of paper looks like a triangle. And now you're going to fold in half again, like hot dog. And now we're gonna make the wings, okay? So you wanna fold the outside of the paper. So this was before and after to fold in half to make a wing. We're gonna do the same to the other side. And now we have our paper airplane. So this is just one way that you can make it. You can invent your own way. You can make it smaller. Um, something that someone taught me, you can rip this piece at the bottom to make it more sturdy when you throw. You can flip the wings in to make it more aerodynamic. There are so many ways that you can change your paper airplane. You just have to figure out which works best for you. And this is my airplane. Um, so now when you test them, you can throw them down, you can throw them up, you can throw them sideways. It all depends on how you want to launch them. Um, and kind of ask the questions, uh, why do you think your airplane flew the way it did? How can we make it better? Which type of paper worked best for the paper airplane? Um, which paper is not working so great? Um, is it better if we make big airplanes, little airplanes? Um, there's just so many different ways that you can make an airplane. Um, so that's it for me. So I hope you guys enjoy your paper airplanes and have lots of fun.